slowly, slowly present the picks and uh, take a look at Monday Night Football to start us off with the Cowboys and the Giants. Um, I don't know. This is funny. Remember I said, you know, uh, the game of the week now is on, you know, Sundays at 1 or Thursday or whatever. And now we have the Cowboys and the Giants, a real barn burner for Monday Night Football. Uh, but we can say it's a close game, so I guess that'll be uh, that'll be fun. Yeah, so it, it is going to be uh, whether or not it's going to be a, a barn burner, right? <laughs> you know, the Giants, we know they've lost the last 10 here versus the Cowboys. Uh, Giants are fifth in rushing, uh, 31st in the pass game. They have a 10th-ranked defense against the run, 18th-ranked here versus the pass. Uh, you know, you have Barkley, though. He's still, you know, quite quite the guy, quite the player. Second in the NFL, uh, 236 yards rushing here per game. Uh, you know, it's one of these that the trends have been uh, a long time between these two individually, you know, to the under. But for me, I'm going to take a chance here on the over between these two teams. The over is 5-2 and two in their last seven meetings. Um, I expect, uh, you know, not so much uh, – Defense here today, I guess, from those Giants. Maybe people could take advantage of their uh, of their opportunities here today. I'm gonna take the over. Well, you're definitely getting the best of the number. I mean, the the way early number had this as high as 45 and a half. I think that was a Dak Prescott uh, number, right? So right. let's see what Victor has to say here. <laughs> Watch your mouth, Ramon. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hey, I mean. I tell you one thing I used to love to do uh, for about, oh, I want to say seven or eight years in a row back when, uh, in the day when I was younger and we travel, you know, travel around a little bit was I made it a, a, I went to the Thanksgiving Day game in Dallas for about seven or eight straight years. I had a friend that lived there and I would just go there for Thanksgiving and go to the game and uh, I was at the Leon Lett. Oh, game. you were awesome! <laughs> that was the coldest I've ever been in my entire life. I'm from Southern California. I'm from San Diego. I really don't even, you know, no, barely, barely see snow or anything like that. And uh, <laughs> to go to that game and not, I was not prepared uh, with snow. one pair of socks on to what was going to happen. Uh, that was the coldest I've ever been in my life at that game. But at least I saw. Uh, a memory for a lifetime right. uh, at that game. I also saw that Dallas play the Redskins a couple of times. I saw them play the Vikings. So uh, I used to love that Dallas Redskins game. That was my fave. <laughs> I always went to that went to that game. And Matt Matt says that we can look ahead to the Thursday night game. Yeah, will Tua? Will there be anything that? Because usually, if they can determine a concussion, I, I don't know. Uh, you wouldn't play the next week type of thing, you know, so we'll see. I mean, there's like an investigation going on right now into that. And I don't know, to the naked eye, it just seems like if a guy gets up, was like that. <laughs> yeah, right. now, now back in the day that never, you never had that issue. Two guys would get wobbly and, you know, stay in the game or whatever. And, you know, the real problem, I mean, the damage is already done when you've been hit, but what you're trying to prevent is, a set is getting hit again immediately afterwards where that's where, you know, we see it, you know, the, the CTE is a real deal. And every, everybody that puts on these helmets, these weapons of mass destruction on their heads. And uh, now, uh, you know, unfortunately we're all seeing the, re, you know, results of it uh, down the line, years down the line, especially because now we think about, I don't want to get on a tangent, Mindy. This is a gambling show, right? But, uh, you know, where the the speed of the game over the last 20 or 30 years, I mean, people will still live longer, long lives and stuff like that, but we're seeing down the road the NFL players uh, and, and football players in general, uh, you know, have the, the CTE, and right. that's what they're trying to, you know, protect against. The damage has already been done, and uh, – Anyways, uh, we'll see if he's in there. Let's get back to this game, though, Mindy. Certainly you like the over. Uh, look, I think Cooper Rush, I mean, I, I don't know. I think the, the tendency is to, think, you know, maybe roll with the Giants a little bit at home. But, you know, once Dak was out, the Giants kind of went up to a little bit more of a favorite than this. And maybe the Cowboys are starting to get some attention now because Cooper Rush looked 
decent in the last game. And I like Dallas uh, in this game uh, to win this game tonight. I'm going to give them out as my free play. Um, I like Dallas. I like Cooper Rush. And so I don't want to necessarily, just because Victor said, don't get uh, (laughs) against my Cowboys. I'm not picking them just because uh, Victor uh, said to. And he says he also likes the over. 26 to 14. Wow. And I know he's got to like his Cowboys here, right? Right. <laughs> um, so uh, maybe Victor thinks the Cowboys will get a 12 point victory on the road. That'd be uh, really, really interesting. So, uh, anyways, I'll go with them just, you know, maybe by three or four points. But I'm going to go Cowboys on the road. I like what I see uh, from Rush. And there's nothing much else we, we know what we're getting with the Cowboys, too. And maybe they still. You know, if Dak's in there, right, what's the line, Mindy? Uh, Dallas five. by four? Yeah. Five? Is that Probably. what you said? Yeah, yeah. five. So, uh, you know, it's definitely a downgrade, right? But we haven't seen, especially with the way Rush performed, um, you know, we haven't seen him perform poorly. So let's give Cooper Rush a chance. We saw. Right. <laughs> we even talked about, you know, how he'd played before last week's game. We talked about how he played well in his – uh, appearance last season. So uh, I'm going to go with the Cowboys here and uh, you will go with the over and uh, there's our picks for Monday night football. We got them. Two yep. great picks. 